In this video, we want to find the inverse Laplace transform of s of s plus 3 over s squared minus 4s plus 29. Let's rewrite s plus 3 as s minus 2 plus 5 and rewrite s squared minus 4s plus 29 as s squared minus 4s plus 4 plus 25. And the reason we're going to break it up like this is because we want a factor. We know that s squared minus 4s plus 4 can be rewritten as s squared minus or s minus 2 quantity squared so and then 25 is just 5 squared that's going to be the denominator and then from there we're going to make two fractions the first fraction is going to be s minus 2 and the second fraction is going to have 5 in the numerator from here we need to use the fact that the inverse Laplace transform of s minus a over s minus a quantity squared plus b squared is equal to e to the at times cosine of bt. So that's what we're going to use for the first fraction. And for the second fraction, we have the inverse Laplace transform of b over s minus a quantity squared plus b squared is equal to e to the at times sine of bt. Obviously, a is going to be 2, b is going to be 5, plugging it in we get the answer as e to the 2t times cosine of 5t plus e to the 2t times sine of 5t. And here we can factor out an e to the 2t and have this as our final answer.